Question 20, and this is a mix of, a, of an indices question and, sorry, 21, a mix of an indices question and a uh, search question. So, the first one, we need to remember that uh, anything to the power of one third is equal to the cube root of that number. Okay? So we've got to find, here we've got the, the denominator is 3, so we've got to find the cube root of 27, and then we need to square the answer. So the cube root of 27 is 3, because 3 times 3 times 3 is 27, and then I have to find that squared, which is just 9, so my answer is 9. Part B is the um, thirds bit, so I've got 8 minus root 18 over root 2. Well, I'm going to times this by the number 1, because then I don't change its value. But I'm not going to use the 1 in that form. Um, I want to rationalise the denominator. So what I want to do is rationalise the denominator. Okay? So I'm not going to choose the 1. I want to get rid of this square root 2 on the bottom, but without changing the value overall. So I'm going to choose, oops, I'm going to choose root 2 over 2 as my value of 1. So then, that gives me, as the denominator, root 2 times 2 is just 2. And then I multiply both these numbers by root 2, so I get 8 root 2 minus root 36. You can see that the root 2 times the root 18 is root 36. So following that through, I get... Uh, I'm going to get 8 root 2, well I can do the root 36, which is 6, over 2. And then I'm just uh, going to half both sections. So 8 divided by 2 is 4. 4 root 2 minus 3. Which, just to get it into the a plus b root 2 form, I'm just going to write the other way around. So the number bit first is minus 3, and then 4, oops, and then for root 2. So that tells me that the a must be worth minus 3, and the b, the number in front of the root 2, is positive 4. And that's it, finished.